Hey everyone, Matt here. Today we're going to talk about how to hand catch and hand launch a drone anywhere between a Mavic 3 Pro to a DJI Mini 3 Pro. So let's get into it. So a lot of you are probably wondering why you'd want to hand catch and hand launch a drone. Well, this is a perfect example of why you'd want to hand launch and catch a drone. If you're anywhere where there's high vegetation or if you're on a boat or anywhere you can't have a level surface where you could land the drone safely, you're going to want to have a ability to hand launch and hand catch a drone. And that is what we're going to teach you today. All right, so a lot of you are probably wondering how easy is this? And I'm about to tell you this is extremely simple and you can do this with any drone by DJI out there. So all you're gonna wanna do, the first thing you should know is if you want to hand launch your drone, you're gonna wanna hold it above your head. So that way you're not hitting yourself with the propellers if anything crazy happens. The first thing you're gonna wanna do is go to the automatic launch and do take off by holding the center button here. The drone motors will start and the drone will launch from your hand. It's that simple. And if you want to land the drone, all you want to do is to bring the drone down to about here, hold your hand underneath the drone like this, and hold down on the left thumbstick. The drone motors will stop and it will land in your hand, super simple. Anybody can do this, and like I said, this can be done on any DJI Mavic 3 or DJI Mini 3 or DJI Air 3. Any of those drones, you could do this, and it's a very useful thing for anybody to learn because you never know when you might need to use it. All right, just to show you how simple this is, we're gonna do this all in one take so you can see exactly what I see when I hand launch and hand catch my drone. So Han, if you wanna come over here quick. All right, you'll notice that there's an arrow pointing up on the left-hand side of your screen. You're gonna to wanna to press that. You wanna make sure your drone is away from your body and above your head so if anything happens, the drone's not coming back and hitting you. You're gonna to wanna to press and hold this takeoff button. The drone will start the motors and take off from your hand. It's that simple. And if you wanna land the drone, bring it down to about here, bring it a little bit closer to you. And if you put your hand under it and you see it starting to go up, that's okay. That's completely normal. What you're gonna to wanna to do is hold your hand underneath the drone and also hold down on the left thumbstick. The drone will start to land and the motors will stop and that is how you hand catch and hand launch your drone. It's that simple and anybody can do it. One thing to note when you are hand catching your drone, make sure you pay close attention to hand placement. You wanna make sure your hands are below the props so you don't get cut. To demonstrate that you can do this with any DJI drone, I'm gonna be showing you with my Mavic 3 Pro in the same exact way that I showed you with the Mini 3 Pro. So I'm gonna press up on the arrow again, make sure I hold this away from my body and hold the arrow up. As you can see here, it takes off just the way the Mini 3 did. We're gonna land it the same exact way in my hand. I'm gonna hold it, my hand underneath it. And as you can see, it's the same exact way with the Mini 3 Pro and all DJI drones. So hopefully I was able to help you guys learn how to hand launch and how to hand catch a drone. It's a very simple process and something I feel like everybody should learn. So let me know in the comments below if this guide was helpful for you. And please give me a giant like if this guide was helpful for you because it will help this video grow and it'll help my channel grow. And please subscribe to the channel if you want to learn about photography, videography, and also like a lot of drone stuff. We basically do a lot of drones, photography, GoPros, that kind of stuff on this channel. So if any of that kind of stuff interests you, please subscribe to the channel. So until then, thank you again for watching and I'll see you in the next one.